Hello everyone, uh, today we're going to be unboxing this Boya M1 Pro Universal Lavalier microphone. Uh, this is the upgrade to its predecessor Boya M1 microphone. Uh, it's, I hope my camera catches that, it's BYM1. Uh, it's from the same company, Boya. Uh, basically, it's a budget friendly microphone but it works really well and most of the people are using this microphone uh, because of its quality features and yeah so let's get into the unboxing so this is the box that i got right now uh, a while ago uh, a while ago means maybe an hour ago so uh, i'm going to be unboxing but first i think we should go through the features so uh, this is the box difference. Uh, this one is fairly clean and I hope this is clear enough. This one is a little bit thicker, this thing. Uh, this is called the condenser, I believe. And uh, this one is thicker and this one is pretty thin as compared to that. I'll be comparing that when I unbox this microphone and the, the difference is that the frequency range of the m1 is 65 to 18 kilohertz 65 hertz to 18 kilohertz not 65 kilohertz so for the m1 pro it's 70 hertz till 18 kilohertz and the signal to noise ratio which is also called snr it's 74 decibels uh, SPL and for the uh, M1 Pro it's uh, 78 decibels or more so the sensitivity is uh, identical on both of them is minus 30 decibels plus minus 3 decibels and the connectors both are 3.5 millimeters and yeah the other stuff is pretty identical both uh, have LR44 batteries and and have a six meter long uh, cable so let's get into the uh, unboxing so uh, uh, this is the box and when I open the box I get the uh, this thing nothing else in the box oh I do have a, a paper so this is pretty much for the box and if you want to read this you can pause the video and read it i hope it's clear enough and some paperwork uh warranty policy not to mention this uh, microphone comes with a one-year warranty and some stickers i think which is nice now let's come to the microphone uh this comes with a nice carrying pouch and let's get the microphone out of the pouch and this is the microphone and the condenser i talked about earlier this one uh, the main feature i'll be talking about in a minute the this one the uh this is the main thing the uh, uh the attenuator or gain basically uh, zero and minus 10 decibels this is the usual switch if you want to use it on the uh smartphone you can toggle to the smartphone or if you want to use it for the camera like me uh, you can toggle to the camera like this uh there you go uh I have to wait a little bit to for the camera to focus so yeah and let's see what else in, is in the pouch this is a six meter long cable uh, 3.5 millimeter jack and this is the microphone itself now this is what we get in the uh, pouch let's open that and the clip and the foam for better sound quality to put it on like this one this is very handy of course and 
I'm sure you're pretty familiar with uh, this jack. Uh, you might have seen in the bigger uh, amplifiers and stuff. So it doesn't. It, it's not useful for me, but yeah, it can be useful. Might come in handy later on. Who knows? Now let's get into the uh, comparison. Uh, basically, uh, this one, the O1 Boya M1, which I'm using right now to record this video and uh, yeah this is good so this one comes with the same button i told you about the uh, camera and uh, smartphone nothing else and this one uh, uh, has a battery inside of it so if you want to change your battery you can yeah change it from here so and let's see the other microphone now you can see this is this one is the boya m1 uh i'll hold it upside down uh this is good okay so this one is a uh, boya m1 this one uh, in my uh, left hand in my right hand it is boya m1 pro so basically uh there is a feature that might come in handy if you're in like a noisy environment uh, normally you would keep that on zero decibels and if you're in noisy environment where you want yourself to be heard on camera only you can switch it to uh, minus 10 decibels i'll be testing that in a minute but i'm just telling you about the comparisons and not to mention this one doesn't come with any headphone jack but this one comes with a 3.5 millimeter headphone jack where you might want to plug it in uh, to see if your audio is recorded and if you however you want it to record it like the quality or the gain or whatever it is so yeah this one so right now I'm recording with this one Boya M1 uh, microphone so I'm going to change into M1 Pro. All right. So uh, one thing you want to do is uh, open this, the new microphone, uh, its condenser, where uh, you change your battery. But initially, the battery is installed in here. This is a plastic that was the contact. Like these are produced in bulk and they never know. Uh, when uh, the customer is getting it and if the battery stays in here for long this might uh, destroy that let me see if that focuses it I hope uh, it's having trouble focusing it uh, there you go uh, anyway so what you want to do is remove this plastic like this uh -huh. it's a bit tough there you go now it's removed and it will work this is the plastic in case you're wondering uh, that was between the uh, cells and cell i mean the cell and uh, the microphone's uh, contact points so yeah this is what you want to do and then after that you close it like this and use your microphone however you want to do okay so right now I'm recording on this Boya M1 Pro as you can see and the sensitivity of the microphone is set on zero decibels and this is how I sound right now uh, I'm gonna switch to uh, minus 10 decibels uh, and you could see how that sounds and now I'll switch to minus 10 decibels here you go I uh, now I'm on minus 10 decibels and uh, you can observe uh, might have been like uh, softer or something like that um, you might have 
like you might hear less noise uh, right now because the uh, gain of the microphone is decreased by minus 10 decibels uh, I'm gonna uh, change into zero decibels again so maybe you want to notice that again in case so here you go here it is and yeah this is how it is uh, I've made a small graph by the way which explains a little bit about the uh, how that is this is basically the decibel scale let me just write that quickly for you and uh, this is the frequency and this is the gain that is in decibels uh, here you go so these are the frequencies that you can see this is not linear of course uh, this is 20 Hertz uh, 1 kilohertz and 20 kilohertz uh, basically uh, a human can hear from 20 Hertz to 20 kilohertz and this is the uh, gain in decibels uh, you can see this is 0 decibels and this is minus 3 decibels and uh, of course this is not ideal I uh, might change for different uh, uh, microphones and my uh, different audio devices and this is minus 10 decibels you can see the uh, gain decreases and the frequency range increases like on the lower side and you can see that uh, this is a tiny bit technical but I wanted to explain in this video so yeah if you want to buy this microphone uh, for your own self uh, I'll be linking uh, down in the description and yeah uh, you can buy it and have it for yourself anyways I hope you like this video if yes then uh, like share and subscribe and I guess uh, I'll see you in the next one peace